a instrumental like if I was rapping just imagine of that I'm rapping right and how it sounds it just sounds great the high the meat the lows it just sounds fantastic and if you get closer to the mic oh yeah that was part of the beat <laughs> I cut it right there yeah I, I so you want to know how this microphone sounds the sure VLX SM58 wireless. You are listening to the microphone being processed through Reaper, my DAW, my uh, digital workstation, where I, you know, do music mixing and whatever. I'm going to go ahead and turn off the processing to the microphone. So right now there's nothing going on with it. It's just straight from the receiver to the focus right to I2 and then to the headphone splitter. The microphone comes in this beautiful carrying case. Very well foam padded. You probably clicked on this video because you want to know if this is a good microphone. You probably want to know if spending $379 or probably you're looking for it on eBay used, right? And you want to know, man, spend 250 bucks for the microphone worth it. Well, let me tell you something. I've tested a whole bunch of different wireless microphones. And there, I've done some videos of them on YouTube and some videos I haven't. Another microphone that I'm going to be testing is the Sennheiser. What are my thoughts on the Shure BLX SM58 microphone? What do I think? I've been using this microphone in our church, so it's live performance. I have also been using this microphone here in my room to do my rehearsing on my music because I love music. I love uh, singing and doing a little bit of rap and you know, singing a little bit of gospel music and whatnot. This microphone sounds fantastic. Now, you're probably wondering, what is that in there? Well, this is a windscreen pop filter. Because if I remove it, pop filter. The microphone is not so bad, right? This microphone is not that bad for pops. Pops, 24. 24, now if you like blow it straight into the mic, then it's going to receive it. You know what I'm saying? Pop filter just so i can feel more secure about me getting close to the microphone i like putting the pop filter and then even though uh, it doesn't look that good you know what i'm saying you're gonna listen to the microphone right now equalize and i'm gonna tell you exactly what it has in it equalizer from reaper it's got the compress the compressor from reaper and it's got an old school reaper from boxengo now this is going uh, it's being processed through the DAW, my digital workstation because I don't have a mixer, but we do have a mixer in church. In the microphone, live performance, like when you are performing live, it sounds beautiful. We have another SM58 in church, and we have a uh, Sennheiser um, E39, I believe. That's the brand. A beautiful microphone, beautiful dynamics. I used to have it here on my desk when I used to do the live streaming because the microphone um, is really quiet. So what happens if I move the microphone sideways? Is it going to pick up enough of my voice? Probably not. And that is the beauty of these microphones. Once you move the microphone, it's, it's really hard to even pick up anything, right? It's really hard to even pick up anything. And that is a good thing because you don't want the microphone picking up all the sound of the stage. You know, the drums, the bass, the guitars, the other singers. You don't want any of that. And that is the beauty of these microphones. So I wanted something that I could rely on and I know that this microphone was the best choice. So now let's go ahead and listen to the microphone. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and play some um, one of my beats. Uh, my beats. I own the copyrights of this beat. So YouTube, don't, don't try to start anything, okay? All right. Let's do it. Yo. All right. Sounds beautiful. I'm not going to do any singing, any rapping, because you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to be doing the, a little bit of commentary over the beat this is a reggaeton beat right and <laughs> you're listening to the microphone fully processed right live processed i'm not doing this on post like on on a, um what is it called premiere pro i'm not doing it in there this is recorded straight from the headphone all the way into the dslr 
So let's pretend you are up on the stage. You have this mic on, right? You're performing. You're singing. And it sounds beautiful. It sounds beautiful. Let me see the EQ of this microphone. Um, the EQ, I put a little bit of the bass down and I raise up the highs a little bit to give that crisp sound, right? Live performing, crisp sounds. That's what you want to have, right? Let's go. <laughs> That's how I cut the beat. But anyways, if you're a hip hop artist, and if you, if you're a hip hop artist, and if you got invited to, you know, a quinceañera or a birthday party or whatever celebration that they got going on, if you, if your church or whatever you're doing, if you're in the industry of music, you know, this happened to me before. I went up and I sang up on the stage and. The microphone that they handed me, it was a wireless microphone. This happened to me twice. Uh, they handed it to me and the battery dies. So I was actually doing the hype for another uh, rapper and I was up there with no sound. And I was like, there's no sound to the microphone. So what you wanna do, if you are getting into, if you're a country singer, if you're a rock star, if you wanna be a rock star or you know, rock music, uh, corridos, whatever, music you're going into, make sure you have your own microphone. And what better microphone than the Shure BLX? Well, there's a better, there's a, another version of this microphone, right? Like, there's, there's other versions where it shows the LED uh, battery indicator here in the channel and whatnot. Those are little cosmetics. The fact of the microphone is the SM58. And a true musician is going to give a thumbs up on this video because they know what I'm talking about. So if you're thinking of buying this microphone, I'm gonna give it thumbs up. The microphone sounds fantastic, but I'll go ahead and get rid of the uh, processing of the microphone so you don't think, well, he's manipulating the audio. He doesn't really know how to review a microphone. I've been around the music industry for a little bit. I don't call myself that I know everything. I just know a little bit, right? And I can say that this microphone is good. Good investment. I tell you that much. This was your host, Sergio with the Cover Clock. I will see you guys in the next video. I'll be reviewing more mics. Ooh, baby. A instrumental, like if I was rapping, just imagine of that I'm rapping, right? And how it sounds, it just sounds great. The highs, the meets, the lows, it just sounds fantastic. And if we get closer to the mic. Oh yeah, that was part of the beat. <laughs> I cut it right there, yeah, I, I 